Thank this you. conference will now be recorded. Okay. So our syllabus will be mainly analog layout will be 90% because the market hiring will be more in this case. Okay. And standard cell IO layout also combined. So all three combined means custom layout. Okay, memory also sometimes some company are including some company will be separated for memory layout. Okay, but mainly custom layout is combination of standard cell, analog, and IO. Okay, so don't confuse what is custom layout and analog is separate, but is the part of custom layout. Okay, so this is the main difference. Okay, so anybody having doubt, you will ask me in between. Any query about? Okay, so we have 40 lab classes and 40 theory classes. So every classes after one lab session also there, or will be combined like three in between three hour classes, you'll get lab session and theory class. Okay, so this is the flow. Okay, so what is analog layout and and what is the digital? So there is in the industry you will be get the chip. There is a two type of chip. One is analog means in the chip you will get analog block also there. And digital blocks will be there. There will be memory, IO, ESD, IO means input output block. Okay, so the, in the chip, many circuit will be there. So you will be so who will do that. Okay, so there will be front end and back end. So that concept also you need to learn. I means you have to get idea. So front end in software industry like your web developer, so there will be front end and back end. So like some testing people are there, some developer will be there. So here also in VLSA industry, there will be front end people and back end people. So front end means your for digital RTL designer is called front end, and for back end it is called physical design people for here analog analog designer is the front end people and analog layout is the back end so just remember this analog layout in the analog domain as it is like it is same in the digital domain it is like physical uh, design and some company for verification verification means digital verification are there physical verification for pd verification they require PVPU, physical verification for digital verification or functional verification are there that is for actual design verification is whether that uh, system is correct or wrong okay so so analog verification nobody require you people need to do verification. so for verification we are using analog people what will do for verification if anybody having doubt, if some people will visit the new because just uh, we take pass out people, so they have no idea. So you will be too mainly DRC. LVS. Okay. And fourth plan. routing this is the main work of the analog layout people or you can tell custom layout people so everything will be same analog io the work will be same memory little bit different okay. now we'll be teach you what is custom layout people what will do or analog layout Okay, so if anybody is not getting, you can ask me.
or this is the new concept like you are not have any doubt you can in between you can ask me that's the not thing uh, hello sir yeah, yeah. Uh, sir uh, uh, you explain about the floor plan like so how does it uh, like come into the unlock uh, you know layout concept yeah, yeah that we will discuss now only okay Any, uh, yeah so first you understand what is floor plan so you are making a house or you are designing a house so you have to, uh, what you you hire a architect okay so he will give you uh, like uh, your certain area so you have fixed certain area like this is the 1700 square foot some x axis on y axis let us jump so in this area you have to design your house so if you design the house you need to plan like where it will be your master bedroom where it will be your balcony where you are entering and uh, you plan like okay but how betterly betterly you need to plan that is called the floor plan so in that layout also how will it become so you have certain divide in layout people means your LSA industry what very large scale industry but they are consist of CMOS CMOS means in MOS and PMOS so MOS will be there so there will be in the device even 1 lakh or 10,000 number of MOSs are there generally MOS and register capacitor you will not find extra that in so you have you need to arrange how properly it will be depends upon your so many character depends upon your current flow okay your power okay like your laptop you have to see or you can say pen drive inside there the chip you are there in pen drive your processor sorry in laptop your processor are there ARM processor or AMD processor Intel so they are also called small chip so it having different function okay so when you design it needs a power also so for power also separate some area will be allocated for power okay some functional so it will be allocated so you need to support this much area you have to given so you will need to arrange that device how properly it depends upon its functionality but i will given just example power suppose input and output input means where your current is going or suppose you want to in laptop that is a for pen drive how many pins are there that is your data will be trans come and data will be transferred through pen drive it will be transferred so so that will be some data will be transferred to your chip also so how it will be stored so it, it certain area will be allocated and how will be arranged that will be learned here suppose i'll show you the example of a layout how it will be properly arranged mainly for plan means your arrangement of the device depends upon its proper functionality so layout diagram if you see the full chip see this is how it is looking and these are the when they will uh, tap out after that fa fabrication it will go for so you will see a small chip size See, this is the port. main important is the port plan. So then after housing, you plan this like architect people is done. This this is your master bedroom. This is your balcony. Your it is some study room like that. You done initially. It is done. Or that is called when this is fixed called placement. When this placement is done, you need to do like you uh, when you making your house. What you need to do? Then you have to uh, you come across like brick you need cement okay rod and your started first floor second floor like that so here also you need to do like that In layout also that is called routing you, you got i clear like what is floor plan or yes, other sir. anybody have yeah so that is the main thing like and this is here you need to learn how better floor so if you learn the port plan, how you will do? So this thing will be easy, like routing. And this is a DRC LVS, anybody can clear. 
okay next third will be what is drc drc is design rule check means depends upon your technology technology means there are many technology are there suppose your uh, uh, mobile phone they are now they are using 5 nanometer or 7 nanometer uh, qualcomm 865 okay so even apple they have different they have their in own processor okay so like one plus or your mobile like ma ma phone they are using your qualcomm or mediatek so they are using their processor so depends upon the technology file so it is like 7 nanometer if lower technology that it will be very fast like if you see example of a charging of a mobile so it will be take 20 minutes some mobile it will take 20 minutes some mobile you two hour for charging okay so depends upon your technology if your technology less your processing speed will be very fast very fast okay within giga per second it will be processed even data transport like your pen drive also so data will be transferred within very fast speed so that is also the example of a chip what we are using so what is drc it depends upon your technology suppose 7 nanometer it has just separate technology so here we will do 28 nanometer okay so for there some rule will be there we need to follow it so that's why it is called design rule check so if you place uh, after fourth plan if you did some error will ask whether this fourth plan will be correct or wrong that is just called verification if you are verifying it is correct we will not change anything okay so this is like when you place some device it should be how much nearer or how much distance you will be placed that will be identified by DS and fourth is the LVS so LVS is the layout versus schematic so what is layout versus schematic so once the designer designer means that is called front-end people and you need to the correlate and coordination between analog design people and analog layout or you can tell this custom layout in the uh, custom designer versus custom layout so some they are giving some idea also so you need to implement or you are giving some idea so they will also implement that is the coordination between and at last will be verified it means whatever they are doing and you are doing should be compared layout versus schematic so it should be also clean so if possible i'll show you the demo of the tool so at last, so there we will show you the DRC LVS how it is working. So that is the plan. So this is the main four part of this layout. So your flow, like we need to do four plan, routing, then DRC and LVS. Okay, so this is the main focus. And next. So my last two years, so I'm here around three plus years. I'm teaching in the Bhelisai Guru. So last year I'm teaching. So last two years already 90% people are placed. Like Altran and uh, Scient. Uh, around 10 people, seven. 90% mean eight, eight or nine people are placed. Last two batch word placement was good. Okay, so it depends upon the company also. So if your company is coming, even some people are two placement also. Okay, so that is the thing. Next. So what syllabus we need to cover? So initial. Okay, and uh, voltage division rule what is because this is the how you need to do a better layout engineer so you need to know this basic like your flipper clamper low pass filter okay and cmos fabrication so here what is ion implantation what is diffusion photolithography what is oxidation and next okay this is the project Okay, so layout concept. So 
here layout concept means a stick diagram cross stuck shielding matching what is est electrostatic discharge shielding and dfm issue design for manufacturability so they are also some latch up okay so wp so these are the new concept here also this is ld effect or layout different effect this is thing this is the new topic those who are not even and text people also not study so this is the new topic we will cover and what is the project so generally our layout will be like 15 to 16 project you will given so initially some standard cell then left okay so this project if anybody want this page also will share you okay so these are the custom layout project so standard cell current mirror of pump operational amplifier so d flop level shifter ldo ldo is a low dropout and this project will be almost real time experience suppose some people are working experience people also they are doing so this is the already will give in the real times schematic okay and real time experience people those who are working also that type of schematic will give so here low dropout bgr band graph gap reference This is some memory SRAM DRAM ADC will given. So you will given two type of ADC. Last type. This are two example counters we are not going to XR ready successful. Then we can go for PLL edge lock loop and that digital to analog converter and we'll go for serializer deserializers is high speed circuit this you also a part of PLL delay lock loop okay and some demo we do so real time demo so this is the basic now come to okay and this is the one effect is secondary effects in MOS like what is body effect what is leakage di will turn induce barrier lowering velocity saturation hot carrier effect and what is channel length so this topic also will, will cover layout dependent effect so you can see this is the new topics already i told you latch up antenna effect est electro migration this is well proximity effect Length of diffusion. Cellar trench isolates. Okay, so this is just a demo of a layout. Our tool will be showing. Anyhow, I'll show you the demo also. Okay, and yeah, so what is the plan? 
this is a schematic so how if layout people how will they given the schematic first so schematic whole design front end to front end people here like standard cell designer or analog designer or custom designer okay and layout designer what you will do they will create a layout net net list net list means this is connection one form of like some technical term it is called gds this is gds just a file so whatever schematic people do it will be converted to gds under gds file that will be implemented so you will do layout also after that file then this is a schematic this is just an inverter the schematic we are doing will compare like lvs is the compare between layout versus schematic if it is correct then it will find if it is not compared we will do this is just a comparing diagram if the next diagram if you show this is just a layout created so this is the layout flow so layer designer flow like this and there is a two type of thing will be happening one is template template means it is fixed you and standard save some basic app see okay so how it is layout when you are taking some file you need to design yourself everything you will be done by scratch or something it is already given by your manufacturer some company like here we are using synopsis synopsis is already have some files we are, we are going to use that file everywhere it is fixed when goods of register capacitor you are not going to design register that will be fixed by the tool or fabricator and people fabrication people links so there are many company intel samsung uh, tsmc here uh, we are going to tsmc 28 so our technology will be tsmc 28 nanometer or that is also some it will support ibm 32 nanometer so both will be same only okay so any how when i'll show you the tool so you'll get clear in your next i'll show you the tool only okay so before that anybody having doubt you can ask me because some new people will not understand any sir what is analog mixer signal layout sir sorry sir what is analog mixer signal layout oh, analog mix signal layout am i correct yes sir yeah so just take a example this is the basic difference so analog uh, digital means binary so 1 or 0 so it is from 1 or so this is the binary signal binary means this is digital so it will be either 0 or 1 okay so you are giving the signal will be repeated like 0 or 1 it will not change anything but analog means your signal will be vary with respect to time but let us take a example of a sinusoidal signal okay so now we understand by seeing this which signal is the digital and which signal is analog so if you take live example all the power signal power means your supply your current is how it is coming it is will be sinusoidal ac current current ac means alternating current so whenever your chip is connected to ac so that would be definitely analog so all the power signal generally not a just ldo here if you see this is a analog signal so i given ldo load dropout there by power you are using power mosfet okay so there are called analog signal so there will be many example here analog to digital converter adc also what so there will be analog part analog to digital converter digital to analog converter so some converter through use some analog signal will be converted pll so it is be creating for frequency but there analog signal it's application are there 
So there will be many applications are there for analog mixed signal. But this is the basic difference. Whenever your signal is connected to analog signal, analog signal means with respect to time, it will be not given one or zero. You got the point? Yes, sir. You just wait for in between anybody having doubt you can ask me okay so i'll show you some yes, sir in, yeah sir how do yeah, we again. calculate standards sir how do we calculate standard cell heights yeah so standard cell generally standard cell is a nine nor or XR, these are called standard set. In what are also called. So height means so generally standard cell height is fixed. Why? Because these standard cell are repetitive usually. So if you are ma making standard cell height is fixed, like let us assume this height is two micrometer. So there are inverter, XR, many gate are there. So their height will be different. So what will happen when they are aligning? It will be show you like this. So when you are doing some standard cell, they, their height will be fixed. That is the main thing. Then how to calculate height? Next at the topic. The generally remember standard cell height in the real time industry they are going to fix because the height mismatch will be happen, and you are not uh, what is called you are not combining. So major gate will not combine with your NAND gate but because there will be see in few five thousand ten thousand number of standards even sir like two lakh also some chips a big chip will be there they are using two lakh of chips so their height will be different like this so when you are passing the signal it will be go how suppose clock signal you are turn on your passing will be like this it will be rotated okay so this will be not the perfect way to transfer of the signal some people will not understand it will be on it just the basic so when you are transferring something it needs a single way you will be go like this like this that is not the perfect way so now standard cell height will be so there when i discuss big topic i will understand but the, you before that you need to note what is track and pitch So basic things I need to cover, then only you will be understand. Just pitch you remember. So pitch is the center to center distance. So that is a two device are there or two metal. Okay, so some people will not understand. So when you join basic, you will be cover. Not basic, this is in advanced also will cover. This is like a center point. Let this is a metal. It's with these two micrometer. Center point is one micrometer. This is center point is one micrometer. So in between two metal distance is also four micrometer. Each is the center to center distance. So this is four micrometer. This is one micrometer. This is one micrometer. The total distance center to center is six micrometer. So this is called pitch. Which is the center to center distance between two metal. Metal is just a conductor. Metal when you when you carry current, like where you are uh, or your laptop charger, their current is flowing. So that is also a metal. Made aluminium, your example, silver, gold. Okay. So that are Metal.
okay so before that it will be take time i'll uh, if time is possible i'll show you the how to calculate because i need to cover everything what is track then you will not understand what is metal also okay any of before that i'll show you the tool that is the main important yeah so any other having doubt this conference will now be recorded i'll 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 be recorded Okay, wait for two minutes. I'll share the link. I'll share the tool. Okay. Is audible? Yes. Okay.
சார் யூ ஆர் நாட் ஆடிபிள் சார் ஓகே சார் நவ் இட் இஸ் ஆடிபிள் எஸ் சார் எஸ் Okay, so what I am telling, in Samsung interview, they ask like this, suppose 9 nanometer, this is 9, sorry, 9 ohm, this is all three are 9 ohm. So calculate what is the resistance between A and B. Okay, so initially we will give in port ready place. dedicated class means for r equivalent kvl and kcl so if some people are not background strong fully cover so whatever in the only interview question they are asking so minimum one two class i mean in the interview they are asking for how to calculate resistor divider okay, what is voltage divide, division rule what is so like this type of question they will ask so anyone can tell the answer you need to calculate the resistance between a and b okay so this answer will be nobody is giving answer yeah these are ohm only nine ohm so you have to calculate the resistance between a and b okay so this answer will be 3 ohm only so how to calculate suppose a this point let it be this is already a is there so if you see in between there is no resistor so this point also a this point b means this is also b because in between there is no resistor so this point also same point so now a and b how many resistor you are seeing so a to b i know already this also a to b i know so how can you represent a to b i know somebody tell why you are not writing straight line so if i put a place like this i know it will be like another point see you will come so that is not correct so only option you have like this okay so all three are in parallel so parallel you know resistance will be so first two ohm you can find otherwise 9 by 3 shortcut will be there how many is same resistance means you have divided by few times mean how many times it will be divided if it is not parallel you can calculate the same a and b divided by a plus b so 9 into 9 divided by 9 plus 9 so it will be
9 into 9 divided by 9 plus 9. 81 divided by 9 by 2 again 9 by 2 parallel with 9 a into b divided by a plus b If you solve this, any you will get the 81 divided by 2 27 divided by 2 2 to cancel, 27 divided by 2 and there is 3 Okay, so this is the way, so this is the type of example you will tell and the discussion will be like a real This is a Samsung 2019 So what they ask? Okay, so this current is 10 ampere, this 3 ohm, this register is variable. Variable means you can take 1 ohm. So, exact same question what they ask 1 ohm, 2 ohm, 3 ohm. Like in, if you go to infinite, so register is variable resistance. So, calculate the voltage. Voltage is V here across 3 ohm. This is 10 ampere. Okay, so this type of question they are asking. So only two questions will discuss, then we'll go for two. Sir, I think we can use current division formula over here and calculate the value of R and then use the voltage division formula to calculate the voltage across uh, three ohms. Okay, so current will be divided when this is a series circuit. So current will not divide it. Oh, because okay, current okay. passes. So, yeah, for theoretical, if you understand, current will be not divided. Okay. It needs a path. So when number current will be divided. So let this is one current I. It will be divided when two paths will be created like I1 and I2. But it will there is no path, only one path, like you can go 
called it one close bar. Okay. So this type of tricky question will ask. So we will be cover all the topics. So in, initially, this is the KVL case here. Yeah, any other answer? Yeah, so somebody is given 30. So that is the correct answer. So if you take any voltage, it will be 30 volt on. Why? Because current will be same. Already I given the answer. So current, if you change any resistance, like one ohm, two ohm, in series current will be same. Only. So this current will not going to change. This is a ten ampere. It will be flow. When ten ampere will flow, you know voltage formula current into resistance. So this three ohm into ten thirty. Any you you can change this resistance to one ohm also. This voltage will be 30. Even if you change to 4 ohm also, irrespective of this variation, this voltage will be fixed. That's why this is the answer. Anybody having doubt? The series I am just putting current will be okay, will be same for series. The current means your electron direction. Electron will be through opposite direction. But wherever current will be, it needs a closed path. So only one closed path will be there. If sometimes, if same question, what will be? I given So can you tell now what is the answer? What is the resistance and voltage diagram? So this is again if somebody is not visible 2 ampere, 5 ampere, 7 ampere. I think the net current will be 14 ampere because uh, 7 and 5 are flowing in one direction and 2 is flowing in another direction. I think 7 okay. plus 2, 7 plus 5, uh, 12 minus 2, 10, uh, 10 ampere will be the net current. Yeah, yeah. not 14. Yeah, now it is clear. So this is same answer, answer will be same one. Same 30 volt. So 10 ampere it is going to yes. So it will be series only 10 ampere. It will be irrespective of resistor when it change. So now 10 into 3 30 volt. The same answer will be same. Yeah, any other having doubt? So how it is going? What is so current division means incoming current equal to outgoing current so let's take this node or you can tell this node also anything actually we need to find this current only so first you find what is this current this is just a node so 
this is just a i what is i direction i given so who is incoming current incoming is arrow arrow is when is pointing to dot this is incoming so five is incoming outgoing incoming current so this current divisible means incoming current equal to outgoing outgoing current so only one current is incoming outgoing outgoing is 2 plus i so i you got p m p always apply the current division rule at the point of node the node is the connection between your branches so these are called one branch second branch third branch next point this is also another node in this node this i already you got 7 ampere sorry 3 ampere so this is your i1 just apply same thing incoming incoming is 7 plus this is also incoming 3 this is outgoing outgoing means it is going to out arrow is going to out this is let it be i1 or i can given i so i equal to 10 and 4. understand so this is the way you can find okay, any of this thing will be covered in two two three class they will give you many examples so you will not miss any question so this is the extra plus point means some institute will not cover okay so you will give in all the things will be covered here okay so come to our demo yeah anybody having doubt no sir So this is the synopsis 28 nanometer so this is already this is a process design case sad this file where this is applicable for 28 and 32 nanometer now i'll show you the demo suppose like in butter so you will do the schematic also so this is called schematic so this is generally done by the industry analog design so you will learn will given the idea how to design this schematic okay now once this is done means you have to do a check and save so it will show you any warning suppose i will okay so how it will be designed i'll show you the schematic but you are not going to run simulation and under the analog design so don't confuse what is the work of analog designer and analog layout so this is the file library here we will take the schematic so which schematic we will take pmos or nmos so this is inverter inverter just to understand this is cmos cmos is the complementary metal oxide semiconductor so this is consists of nmos and pmos any oil more discussion when i so here 
all the thing will be done by you. Emos and Nmos. I just took an instant and draw. So now I need to connect. I need to keep the. So how many turn? Forty means four terminal. One is source, gate, body, drain. If you place the W, you can design this. With this connection, you will do initially. So layout is very simple course. You don't need to do, learn any background script. So many BTEC people also qualify. Some people no some people are not also from vlsi background like mtech vlsi so they are getting place also and even from electrical brand also so when this is done you know to keep the pin like input pin what is output pin So this is the flow so anyhow it will take time so first inverter it is done so this is a schematic now we'll go for layout So as for the schematic, you have to place like there's a already I told four plan. Program first is PMOS, then NMOS, then Verity VSS. I'll give the pin also. Because this is only one demo class, everything I know not cover. I'm just giving ideas and you will cover everything like what is VMOS, what is NMOS, inside structure of this. So when you draw, see, these are the error, type error. What is the error? So how will you get to know? Check and save when you do. So if it is where is not connected properly, so that time also it will show you some error warning, or your body is floating.
Okay, now you could do check and check. This is already done. Okay, so in the schematic, what is there? PMOS is there, one end mass. So, how we will do? So, we need to do four plan. So, PMOS, how we will place? You take instant, already you have done some PMOS. So, you need to search like PMOS layout where it is present. So this is already I did, this is the PMOS. This is the floor, then NMOS you have to place. So this is called port plan. But how it is, if it is you cannot put like imaginary or blindly. There is a certain rule you need to follow. Like so let's assume. A place like this. Okay. And uh, whether it is correct or not, you need to run the one set of DRC. I already told you in the initial. The DRC it is clean, so then you can go high. If some mistake if you did, mistake means I'll move, move it a little bit more. Like PMOS and MOS are there, just as so like this I did, then I'll run DRC. So you will find some error. Means your placement not correct. So as for DRC, it will be placed. So this is the way. Then LVSU is there next part after P new place. Okay, I'll show you how one DRC is coming and how to clean. See, it was previously clean. Now DRC error. Go to one error. Like, it is layer one. P implant to enclosure. P active layer must be 0 0.0 type. Suppose you don't understand also error, just highlight it. So it will show you the which location it is sent. So it is saying here active layer. So active layer if you turn on. So here active layer is diffusion, one layer is called diffusion, that is the active layer. The diffusion should be extend up to 0 0.05. There are many errors in that way. Suppose you highlight, then you have to move the device, then that error will be clean. So, so before starting any layout, you have to make the DRC clean. So I will move this layer down. Like this, and uh, you can run the DRC, it will be clean. Okay, so anyhow, this is a simple demo. You will learn many things because this is you need to do matching, many computer command center. So, if it is many more devices are there. That time matching will be there. Okay, layer technique. How this is? Okay, so if you see our demo, we have completed PLL. 
can see so how much big layout also will be sir i have a question sir hello sir i have a question sir yeah yeah uh, sir uh, some of the companies use technology library up to 5 nanometer so what will be the difference in the layout when we use different library files like 45 nanometer 28 nanometer 22 nanometer what difficulties or difference we see when we use different yeah, library so, files yeah so there are many difference but some basic if you see so this is a, a drc and lvs file will be changed so suppose here it is asking minimum spacing is how much poly to poly spacing let's assume this is okay so there it will be different like it will be less and so low technology this spacing will be reduced higher technology it will be increased that is the main difference regarding the tool okay functionality it will be so regarding tool this one and you will find some low technology your error will be more because congestion area will be low technology what is that so your channel length so technology means your channel length will be reducing Suppose your P mask, okay. So let's assume this is a P mask. P mask or N mask. So let it be N mask or P mask, anything. This is a N mask. N mask having four terminals so one is source drain your poly control or gate see mos and almost same and then mos you my mosfet you have studied might have get okay this is channel so channel means it replacement mode you are creating channel okay enhance mode or depletion type you, you might have studied in the mosfet at that time your channel will be created through creativity some positive voltage negative electron will be deployed the channel will be created this channel length is called your like technology like 7 nanometers the channel length is 7 nanometer okay you are understanding this is the main difference and due to this difference your rule will be different so 7 nanometer your design will rule will be changed so there will be different technology so if it is low technology some advantage so if you see in the linkedin or some people they are hiring they are writing if you know some so after gain experience if you join an industry after two three year experience you will get some type nanometer seven nanometer minimum seven nanometer you should know even i work up to three nanometer tsmc three five seven so i have work already okay so if you your high experience will be go so you will get project but in training institute, they will not purchase that much. That will be very huge cost, 7 nanometer. Anyhow, this institute is giving you 28 nanometer. That also 32 or 28 nanometer, both is applicable. Okay. Yeah, so any other having doubt? Yeah, the, this is almost. I'll sir, I have one more yeah. question. Sir. Yeah, sir. Uh, so what is the major difference between physical design and back end? Uh, he, they will also be doing some sort of uh, floor planning and uh, yeah, routing. Yeah, that here is. also we do. And another thing, so, they are using through scripting. You are, you are here. You are using manually. See how are you doing? I'm just manually. So there is okay. some scripting, yeah, some scripting already there, like TKL programming. 
some block block will be come directly through programming it will come that is the one different and they will an analyze the timing concept like sta static time and analysis set up all time okay so they will calculate because digital that digital signal will be more is the clock signal okay so clock timing is very important but here analog clock is not important you are getting yes like sir yes sir would, yeah yeah so that is the main they need to uh, <coughs> calculate the starting time and means st engine for there also separate some they nowadays they are uh, means some pd engineer converted to st engineer also only for timing analysis simple okay and these are the main port they will also do port plan routing okay and this pbs and physical verification also they are doing this sir one more yes, sir, sir yeah. one more out of uh, out of the box question uh, uh, we usually go for uh, euler's graph method for drawing the digital circuits like fimo uh, nand gate nor gate we follow that uh, what will be the difference if i go for some uh, asynchronous circuits like current mirrors or it could be any other analog circuits there we will be using euler's graph method or there will be method will be totally different no no this will be totally different and that this will is, be covered in yeah. the training well, this method will not cover. That is for digital, ah, okay. and that is for here. Yeah. yeah, yeah. But okay, we okay. are, yeah, we'll cover. See, if it is one is project is uh, serialized with that. There. So there you are using synchronous or anchorous. Both are you are using clock. Like register, we are going to use. Like counter register also we are using. So that time it will be like analog. You are not going to pure. Some digital parts also will be there. So that time like mocks. Okay. Decoder okay, and encoder okay. are there, so yeah, some blocks will be there that we will go to cover. And uh, sir, uh, what is the scope of uh, this particular scope uh, course? Like, uh, what are the job openings and opportunities right now? So that, yeah, that same till now, in last two batch already. So minimum package four point Altron and C and so they place. So if you contact the last batch, around eight people are placed. Okay. So even they are not um, only completed one two month course of the so they also place. So it depends upon company or company means you are getting and the market value see three year in analog layout minimum package is fourteen lakh. Okay. Sir. Now the current yeah market value current value in this, if you join because some service com in company they will give you initially four point five lakh like. Uh, uh, some training period excluding minimum package what i'm telling minimum 3.5 to 4.5 will give but experience experience one two year experience your package will be 10 lakh easily after getting the client you can demand the market value is three years because some company having a bond like this is not for analog layout this is for everything pdp thing or analog design every course if you go okay so this type of service company and product company. If you go for product company, the one guy who was joined for our Samsung, that is the second, sorry, that is previous third batch. So his package was seven lakhs, Samsung permanent employee. So if that company is come to our institute, so they hire one guy. So like that also, some com product company, if you go, your package will be high. But product company, generally what they will do, they will do internship. Like Intel, the very few they will come, but maximum they will do one year internship. After that, they will make conversion. Like they will go, go to like institute and they will go. But service company, they will come to institute and they will pay a little bit less. But anyhow, if you really say industry is one, two year, minimum two year experience, you will be like your high package. Like after part, getting the Two, three year experience your package will be like above minimum is 13 lakh for any domain it is not going to analog domain analog layout even pd everything your package will be less and your package not that much difference in the pd all these things you have to fight means some company will hire you some people pd people are getting 
So you are explained to a lakh, you will get 15, 16 lakh also. Some company will keep it. Like some reputed Texas company, they are giving 28 lakh also. Including some bonus excluding also. Okay, some un bonus and uh, gratitude they will deduct, but any of PF they will do. But if you enhance salary, in, if you include minimum total like you will get. This is depends upon some company. Okay, and uh, that is the thing. And if you ask to our institute, those you place, you can contact them also. If you know, need to carry like clarify your doubts. Those you place also, you can contact. I think the institute are uploading their uh, in our website. They all the placement data are uploading. Uh, okay. And I, yeah. I, yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, uh, sorry, I mean, uh, since you are discussing uh, about the uh, industry and stuff like that, when I have been like passed in 2013 my bachelor's, after that uh, I have uh, pursued my uh, master's degree, which I haven't uh, finished yet. Uh, I got a break in my master's education. Since I want to, uh, I mean, to cover that gap after, uh, I mean, uh, it, it has been two years I have been not doing that master's, I just only finished two semesters. Um, that, that too I have used Cadence uh, and also published one paper on my name. And then my point is okay. that uh, I think is like, is it the gap it can be filled after finishing these courses in real estate or any other institution? Is it, can I get a job easily after finishing the course and everything without any master's degree? Uh, 2013, your gap now. So actually, why are you not showing to master's degree? Mean? I'm sorry. No, no, actually, it is, if you are the what is that is depends upon the industry. They are some okay. service company. They are asking for 2016 batch also. Okay. Okay. No, no, like why, yeah, 1617 or even 18, 19 batch. Why? Because they will make you, they will train you, and they will send to client. Client means so they will show you some one to your gap people also. They are hiring. Why they are hiring to make. They will train you for six months, okay, and uh, they will put you experience to send some client company. Okay. Like this guy is work for our company three years, okay. The okay. service company they will do some client. So for that reason, they are hiring. Like some people are having gap, okay. So and uh, yeah, but that is we cannot to... guarantee. Uh, that is nobody will be guaranteed like current hundred percent placement. That is I'm. Telling. No, no, yeah, I understand. Yes. I understand. And so, uh, yeah, you can talk to our institute uh, management once. Okay. Because they are only bringing, yeah, I'll give you the best uh, training for you. Like in those who are attending, yeah. Mm -hmm. But institute, I will bring because institute management will be bringing company. Okay. Okay. Yeah. They, yeah. Thank you. Yeah, if possible, I, yeah, yeah, I'll share the number also, our management okay. head. Okay. okay. Regarding company, all these things, he will be taken. Okay, man. Thank you so much. Thanks. Yeah, so any other having doubt or we can close. Sir, uh, the class modality, uh, when does the class begin and uh, how exactly the lab sessions are taken? I want to know so with respect to the weekend courses. Yeah, generally uh, next month, I think, we are planning. So if students will be available, because already two, uh, three people joined, so if you, more students we are waiting, then will be next week will start. Means next month, first week. Mm -hmm. I mean, yeah, before that, you will be given the basic class. Basic means already it will be class started. Basic, I already told, so two months basic is there. Na? So you will be like all the PD knowledge, digital, or some basic knowledge you will get, like what is MOS. So it will be better come to analog layout. You should know some one, one month course like basic. So basic, maybe it's already started. Only for advanced, it will be. Yeah. 
you can carry on chandra uh. Uh, I mean, I, I was like, uh, see, I, I, I do understood like the uh, difference between PD and custom layout. So, I, I mean, after hearing uh, some, I mean, at, at least I do have some little knowledge on custom layout. It's, uh, it was very, very hard to, I mean, my friends are discussing about this one. Man, this is very, very hard to get into custom layout since it has, the, it has more technical abilities. The interviews is very hard to crack and everything. They have been like saying these things to me. So, any comment on that one, man? No, no, it will be easy only. Its course syllabus will be very easy. But in, yeah, depends upon the market value. So market is not guaranteed, it will be fluctuated. Sometime hiring would be so that's what I'm telling. Last two batch was uh, placement was very good. Even some I mean, students don't know anything, they just passed the BTEC, even second division students, even. That guy, so he placed in the good package, like 5.5 like package he placed. Okay, so it's not, it means whatever syllabus, you can talk to many people are So already I'm telling, last uh, two best students, uh, they can contact them. So it will be very easy to cover that topic. It will be simple, it means you no need to that much effort. It will be for learning analog layout it will be very easy compared to all other real estate homes. Learning concept, I'm telling for going to industry I means getting a job a different concept. Getting a job means depends upon the market value. Because uh, if it is their hiring means bulk hiring will be done, so you will be get place. There are many industries, Sankalp is there, Altern is there, many service kinds company are there. Now there is some startup also and coming. Uh, thank, thank you, ma'am. Okay, so any other having doubt or you can close? Okay, so thank you all of you. Have a good day.